Okay, so I'd like to show you some of the latest fabrics that I've got in. Uh, these are going to be available soon on blueeyesbowties.com and I'm planning to make them in a mixture of pre-tied and self-tie styles as well as um, some pocket squares as well. Um, leave a comment below to show me which of these fabrics are your favourites or if you have a preference for me making uh, one particular fabric in either a pre-tied or a self-tie style. So the first fabric that I'd like to show you is one that I got recently from Liberty of London and um, it's this one and it's kind of um, basically a blue floral design but it's actually called Gatsby Garden and it does have um, sort of a real kind of twist on it the flowers are they're not kind of really like pretty floral they're much more kind of modern uh, floral which I really like and it's a really beautiful fabric this is a cotton Tana lawn from Liberty of London um, another one that I also uh, got from Liberty is a uh, really quite uh, jazzy fabric. This is a uh, pink and white um, paisley design. This is uh, called Abbey Road and this one um, I got to replace a really popular fabric that I had in um, a few years ago which was white and pink paisley. This one um, you know it's going to be available with a pocket square and potentially cufflinks as well so if you are interested in this and you'd like the full combination of pocket square bow tie and cufflinks do leave a comment let me know and my third and final uh, new liberty fabric uh, this time is uh, i love this one this is a, a fabric called roaring wheels and as you can see hopefully this is a fabric made up of uh, tiny blue vintage cars so anyone out there who's particularly interested in vintage transport this is a really ideal fabric for you uh, or a fantastic gift for someone uh, so they're my three liberty fabrics i went shopping recently and uh, got those I've also decided to bring back a real favourite, which is a, um, a black and gold polka dot fabric. Now, whenever I have black and gold in at blueeyesbowties.com, it always just disappears quickly. You know, people seem to love it. I haven't had one exactly like this before um, in terms of the scale of the dots. These are kind of a, I'd say like a medium sized dot on a black cotton. Um, I've done tiny dots before i've done bigger bigger dots but um yeah this one is going to be available soon again i think i'm probably going to make this one in a self-tie and a pre-tied style so for anyone who you know likes to tie their own bow ties that will be available um to you as well um and just recently i was looking around local fabric shops and i came across something that i haven't actually used when making a bow tie before and that's a um, quite a thick, almost tweedy herringbone fabric. This is really, really lovely. I'm going to make this in pre-tied style um, because it is so thick. I think it would lend itself better to a pre-tied. And I'm actually going to use um, a black, uh, either cotton or a black silk neckband to go with that one. And that's going to produce a really nice shape because the fabric is quite sturdy. Finally then, the last fabric that I'd like to show you is, uh, is this one and it is a grey cotton and it's got tiny neon flecks, pink and green neon flecks. So it's quite subtle but it's also uh, a little bit different and I think that's going to make a really nice self-tie bow tie. So all of these uh, bow ties will be coming to the website soon. Um, if you missed my last video, do go and have a look at that because that shows all of the fabrics uh, that I was working on um, just recently and all of those bow ties are now available at blueeyesbowties.com. Um, also, if you're one of those people who knows exactly what style of bow tie you want to wear, we often find that people are definitely pre-tied or definitely self-tie style, but if you're one of those people who are looking to venture into self-tie and you're not quite sure how to tie a bow tie, then please do check out our how to tie a bow tie video, which just for your own uh, knowledge has been featured on CBS as Hawaii Five O. So good to see you and hopefully see you again soon. Okay. <laughs>